In the 20th century, the United States witnessed the greatest migration in its history. But it wasn't new lands people were discovering. It was cities. By the end of the 20th century, nearly 80% of Americans lived in urban areas. And they no longer knew who grew their food. Then, something happened. People started saying, yes, in my backyard. They started growing food on city rooftops. on freeway off-ramps. And even in their own front yards. They raised farm animals on their balconies, milked them right in their own kitchens, and even keep their own bees. But can these people feed entire cities? No. Instead, it's about reconnecting people to where their food comes from, reminding them that apples come from trees, that milk comes from cows, that chickens lay eggs, and that carrots actually grow in the ground, and that all of it requires people. When you discover where your food comes from, that someone cares for it, that someone grows it, then brings it to you, you develop a different way of looking at food. Urban farming reminds you that food has a face and a name, and it makes food real. To learn more about terms like urban farming, YIMBY, urban apiary, and rooftop farm, visit lexiconofsustainability.com. And remember, your words can change the world. <laughs>